So as we continue through the book of Zechariah, God reminds us of the behavior that's expected. Let's read Zechariah chapter 7, verses 8 and 9. Then the word of the Lord came to Zechariah, saying, Thus says the Lord of hosts, Execute true justice, show mercy and compassion everyone to his brother. So that's quite a list. Let's begin with uh, the true justice part. What do you think is meant by true justice? I mean, can there be an untrue justice? What's this modifier put on the justice part? True justice would be accompanied by the showing of mercy. True justice would be accompanied, Zachariah says, by the accompaniment of compassion. You can't separate justice and compassion and mercy. They, they go together or it's not true justice. It's the same with compassion. We're slow to show real compassion toward each other. You know, it's interesting. We're hearing here about mercy and justice and compassion all together, but uh, these days, we're hearing a lot about AI, you know, AGI, Artificial General Intelligence, or usually just shortened to AI. And the big sales point, you know, I want to sell you my product is, look, we're using AI in our product. You have to buy it. Well, so what is, how do you use AI with justice and mercy? How do you do that? Do you deduct 3%? You know, you have a certain debt that's owed and you deduct 3% so that you're showing uh, mercy? How does that work? Artificial intelligence can't really determine what's justice or what's compassion or what is mercy. Those are, those are human qualities. Those aren't machine qualities. And so uh, today, uh, that big buzzword is just another buzzword in a train of buzzwords. There will be more buzzwords later. Uh, but when we look at, at uh, true justice, which is what God's calling for here in Zechariah's vision here in chapter 7, you can't get it from a, an unbeliever. You can't get it from a machine or a computer. You can't get it really from some kind of an inhuman algorithm. You really have to get it. God is the source of all this, and then we can, we can echo it. We can, uh, we, can, we can translate it. We can, as humans, we can give it. But it's not something you're going to find, generally speaking. And what do we find with Zakaria here? His own, God's own people were not practicing very much true justice. So God tells them, obviously, obviously, if they were okay about it, we wouldn't, we wouldn't have heard about it. But instead, what we have is God is telling them, hey, you guys, you know, you're, you're off the track. You need to do true justice. True justice is always mixed with mercy and compassion. And so we need more of that. That would do, a, do well in the 2020s, wouldn't it? So mercy and justice and compassion, they can't really be separated from each other. God puts them all together, and they're part of this, this really important list. Instead of treating each other with a cold exactness, we are to treat each other as persons made in God's image. I saw something I didn't expect to see the other day. It was a, a, a police officer camera, and this guy was hand, he was alone, the officer, he was handcuffing a fella. I don't know for what crime. And in the middle of the hand, he got the guy handcuffed, and suddenly the police officer began to choke on his gum, and he was really in trouble. He was going to basically choke to death right there on the spot. And the, the guy that he was handcuffing offered to give me the keys and I'll, I'll help. And I thought to myself, yeah, well, we'll see. But of course, he did get the keys. He did manage eventually to unlock his hands from behind his back. And he came and began doing this Heimlich maneuver. Finally got the, uh, this big wad of gum dislodged from the police officer. And then he, he offered himself to be handcuffed again. And the officer said, what, are you kidding? You saved my life. Gives him a big hug. And it was an unusual moment of humanity uh, where there's not a lot of humanity between, between people these days. That's, that's true justice. That's, that's good. There's some mercy and compassion mixed in there. But we need to see more of this humanity expressed. Hey, if an if a officer and a person who's being arrested can demonstrate it, I guess, you know, maybe you and I can demonstrate some of it into the world too. God bless you. We'll see you tomorrow morning as we're still thinking on this business. True justice, mercy, compassion, and on down the list.